Welcome back adventurers, it's Sir Riddle here with Horizon Forbidden West. So last episode, um, we capped off a couple quests, especially the one with Aaron. There's still a few to go. We went into that cave over there. Man, this place is so fucking beautiful. Shit. Uh, we went to that cave over there where um, everyone was drowning because they couldn't swim for some reason. I don't know. Whatever. And um, saved them. And, you know, I did a couple of things off screen as well. Um, I bought some new perks. I upgraded some weapons. I did some fighting. I got a couple skill points. Yada, yada, yada. Um, but there's only so much you can do. Ooh, excuse me, off camera that, um, without, you know, giving away the whole game. So I'm back at it again to play. So let's get into it. So here's one of the guys that we need to talk to. Here to practice friend. I set up some new training while you were gone. So we already like beat this. I mean, we already like got all the fucking tutorials well i did that i got all the skill whoa there's more tutorials oh shit hmm, i didn't even know um so this is the last challenge we have is to actually beat the guy after getting the two skills block breaker and resident resonator blast so we're gonna do that since it's the quest and just cap that off maybe come back later and do it maybe i'll do it off screen because you know it might be a little bit boring almost ready to go so, what trick so i think this is a good chance to like really showcase how excellent the fighting has become. It's just so much more technical. I mean, it's still pretty simplistic. But now we have new combos that do certain things. You know, we can now jump. Oh. We can now jump and slash. It just gives us a little bit more opportunity for um, a more versatile melee combating experience. You know, opponents seem like they want to do more one-on-one -on -one instead of just, like, group attacking you. It's crazy. Oh, shit. We also have, like, this power-up mode that we have now. Series of attacks. See, oh my god. So, you must fight. We have this new ability called Resonator Blast, which ultimately just gives um, this weird energy field that you can hit with your arrows that make, just does extra damage, as well as combos like um, Yield! I yield! block breaker and shit that can break guards and out so it's just really cool you can used to also peel off armor i want to well mention that this guy friend. looks like fucking well desi fought. from like smosh you okay? and he sounds like him too yeah Ooh. serves me right for thinking i could go up against the savior of meridian that's right Here, you big huge this. black man there's no way you can beat this champion. 19 year old white girl thank you oh dark don't be a stranger now come back whenever you'd like to spar again okay Everybody's just so, it's like, shit, man. Hit hard. Everybody's just so sexy. Like, wearing See leather later, straps. Dude. I just, Farewell, what? Then. That's one thing they just needed to fix. <laughs> like, I already walked away. Okay, I got a new dye, Blood Dusk. That's cool. I don't know what that's for, but I'm pretty sure we figured it out. All right, moving on. Moving on. Um, It seems as though, yeah, we completed this. So this must have been this must have um, replaced the hunters trials in the last game, which is pretty cool. Um, we have some more events over here, um, a new quest. I think this just might be the whole just the strike game. So I'm just gonna see what it is. If it is, I might do that off camera and maybe film a bit. I'll even sh um, show you what I've been doing. Um, uh, what was I doing? Uh, never mind. I just I just killed my thought just now. It's okay. Don't worry about it. It happens sometimes. This is not age thing. This is just me being stupid. All right, so let's see. I'm pretty sure this is the strike thing. If it is, again, I will do this off. Oh, maybe not. Oh. Change your mind about that brew. A pint of your finest. Today will be good. Well. No one wants to play strike. No. <laughs> no, bitch, no. For that beer, after all, eh? Here, sit down. 
get a pint in her hand. Wasn't expecting you to swing by. Okay, Thanks Petra, I, I might expected. fuck you. <laughs> There's that spark. Fire and spit. <laughs> uh, fire and spit. Oh, what the fuck is this? Has Aloy ever drank before? That's a blast from the bellows. It's like, what the fuck is this shit? Forge, but at least I can forget about my troubles like, for a while. That shit away. Like what? Well, things aren't as bad since you got this place running again. But we still got Olven grading the gears about his concession decree. If you don't mm. put that down, I'll come over there and show you how that game ends. Oh shit, bitch! Damn. Anyway, right now I'm just worried about those refugees out from Sunfall. To come all this way, enduring Forge knows what. Shadow Carja refugees. What are they doing in the Daunt? Mm, looking for a new home, I gather. They're camped out by an old trailhead southwest of here. So about to go fuck a whole bunch of south, all people. A stormbird crashed up on the cliffs last week, and Tallinn Clean Brokers had his eye on the salvage ever since. But the refugees have barred entrance. Mustn't interrupt their sun scorched ritual. Something about finding a twilight path. Huh. Never heard them talk about that before. Yeah, well, these particular Shadow Karja are an odd bunch. But I'm sure. overall, they're peaceful folk. Not that it matters to Tolland. He'll crack some heads to get to that salvage. Maybe you could swing by. Convince him to set up camp somewhere else? So the bristlebacks in the daunt. <sighs> Dead ass? Yo, she about to fold you, son. Keep playing games. Where did they come from? That's the thing. No one rightly knows. They just showed up one day, rampaging around the valley like they exploded out of a forge. Mm. Lost some good people. There might but be a cauldron over there. the bellows. You cleared them out and got this place working again. That I mean, I do that. Nolvin's plans. I do them now, things. If only there were some way to smash them all together and run them out of town. But how could Bristlebacks and the Daunt help Olvind? Two words. Concession decree. Since no one knows where the bristlebacks came from, Olvind has taken to blaming the Karja for him. He's hoping to dig up enough old resentments to get a strike going until the concession's signed. This is just his latest attempt. Mm. He's been trying to rile up the workers since the day he rolled into town. And people actually believe him? Lots of folks suffered at the hands of the Mad King during the Red Raids. But I was like 20 reason, years ago. Don't blame the Karja for anything. Slavery is ah, over. Damn Karja slavers. That's like the only thing that man has said. Uh, do I care what brought I thought you'd be back in Freeheap. Well, after the big battle at Meridian, I went back. But realized it was running smooth. Didn't need me. Heard about the rebuilding out at Baron Light. Figured they could use another hammer. Been scraping by ever since. You could always yeah. leave. And go back east? Nah. I ain't one to leave a lit forge. Besides, someone's well, you did, gotta though. be a squeaky wheel for the workers around here. Hmm. It's like, I just need to cause problems. <laughs> All right. So I guess I'll that's enough. That way. I'll talk to the refugees. Try to convince them to move. Much appreciated. They have it rough. Don't need Tallinn making it rougher. The fact that Aloy is like, what, 5'4", 5'5", five, 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 and she's shorter? She's a short stack. A I'm, I don't want to play strike. Man. Just... Just milk behavior. Back for that free meal? Go on, peruse my menu. Sure, okay, so this is the food system. Um, how does it work? Oh, okay. Oh, I have to click it. That's stupid. 20% maximum health for source 25. Oh, interesting. Can I get this? Oh, this is the free meal. I'll take the two. Thank you. Okay, this costs like 100 shards. Okay, cool. And this... Do I have these things with me? Oh, I have two items for my food pouch. Okay. Okay. Alright. So, um, these things do a bunch of thing, um, interesting things that I don't feel like I'll need until I really get into the heat of the game. So, do it to know that is that's here. And there's probably more guys like him around. But, okay, I got some items. So, I got a new quest. Um, there's still one more quest over here, which we're going to just check out real quick. What's this? Talk to Toland. Oh, okay. So, we're just going to do a couple of things. 
just before we leave, change scrape and get on to the next part and go to the embassy. All right, let's go. I I'm sorry, I'll be right with you. Uh, oh, okay. Okay, I'm not saying it's a bad idea. I'm saying it's overkill. It's a weapon. <laughs> the sparks. Kill is the point. Not if it blows the user's arm off. No, just, just, right. just stop talking. <sighs> Which is looking crazy. Ah. <clears throat> so, uh, you, you look like someone who's always searching for a new weapon. Why you Am look I so right? shady? Actually, stop I... it. <laughs> what he mud up? Oh. Could you mm. just not? I am with a customer. I, I'm not a customer. I, I never said it. I was buying Triple shit. the powder. It'll blow a Strider sky high. Ba boom. One shot I don't... kill, guaranteed. Um. Hmm. Uh, okay. Maybe I am. Then you are in the right place at the right time, Red. I have a name. How would you like to be the Black? Of the world's first machine enhanced <laughs> explosive, done in one, machine wrecking, yet perfectly safe, javelin thrower. <laughs> Interested? Are you, are you two? Around here? Nah, the claim. The Dad claim. sent us out west in search of some unknown opportunity. Said we'll know it when we see it. Sounds like you had other ideas. Let's just say that opening another trading post for my parents isn't how I want to make my mark in this world. The fuck, bitch? <sighs> Yo, I she's wild. <laughs> must be nice. She's wild in the back there, son. So she's your partner. My apprentice and my sister. Okay, that was a random Zoom call. It was an incident. Another incident. Involving explosives? Ba boom! And Dad's precious homebrew. He shipped us out the next day. <laughs> Damn. Huh. All right, Tell let's hear about this about weapon. This weapon of yours. I saw a scroll when I was a kid by some Karsha scholar who wandered out west. Had a scary drawing of a Tanakh warrior hunting with a kind of javelin thrower. Effective, yes. Basic, undoubtedly. But coming out here made me remember it, and I am on the brink of vastly improving the tool's archaic design. Whereas I will perfect it. I can use machine parts to enhance the user's throw, increase the projectile's velocity. Well, Boomer here is adamant that enhancing the projectile is better. Why not Maybe both? With explosive tips. Boomsticks. Why hmm. not both? Why not both? That could work. There's I know no y'all bitches are not this stupid. I need the parts to make the first working model. Well, for starters, I'll need charger horns intact. Yeah, that. Just be sure to shoot them off before the machine goes down. Otherwise, they break. But the real innovation, and keep it to yourself, is a fang horn rib. There's a mean one east of here. Blow it sky high. Boomer! Can you stop, please? You me. You're it's making me nervous. You have a deal. Okay, we're doing some hunting. Do I have any of those items already? Um, Bigger boom. I do not have any of those items already. So those that's going to be a mission for off screen. Because hunting and gathering is pretty annoying in an overworld type game. I'm pretty sure you guys are here for the story as well as I am. So a lot of the things that um, the minutia of it will probably be done off screen because I just feel like it's uninteresting and probably doesn't serve the overarching story as much as just doing the overarching story. I also um, changed a couple things about the details of the HUD. I have it on all the time now because um, not having items, not seeing where items are is so fucking annoying, honestly. I will scan like seven times um seven times just to get one just to see if there's any items in the room it's just so annoying to remember where they are this is a place i'm not sure how to whoa what the fuck was that yeah so yeah so in these types of games you kind of just want to like go fast you know and not have to be hung up so much you're already searching the you're already like Scanning the area ten times over just to fucking, you know. Why add more unnecessary time just for immersion? I don't see that as necessary. It's good that it's there for people who want it, but not for me. At least not while I'm playing this game, um, on camera. <laughs> All right. These rocks. 
Um, so now we're just going to head down here to figure out where those bristlebacks are because we were supposed to do that last quest. Oh, there's more stuff up here. Um, this is the Twilight Carja settlement. Okay, so I'll probably be going around here. All right. Somehow. We'll do that later again. Maybe off camera. Um, a save. This game is not as forgiving about um, you not saving um, as the last game. If you die, you just like fucking lose a lot. Even your experience. It's crazy. And you just get poured to the next safe space, not like close by. Or at least I think to the, ne the closest campfire. I can't remember. But let's um, just do this quest real quick and then we'll get on with um, the main quest. Acid. Sen tells me that's where I need to go. The bristleback by the falls. Gotta check it out. Yes, sir. It looks like it died on impact. Maybe it charged off the cliff up there. I better I... keep following the trail up. Like a fucking idiot. I like I only got two shards from that. <laughs> Up the trail we go, what we'll find, no one knows. You can suck my nuts. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Never mind. I thought that was something. I was mistaken. Oh, look, one of those shiny green rocks. I like shining green lights. Cool, you got any gear for me, bitch? No? Yes? Okay, well. Go fuck yourself. Oh, jump in, jump in. A lot of broken trees. It's like a stampede went through. Is this where the bristlebacks came from? What's that? How? Unless this cave leads out of the daunt. I don't fucking know, maybe. Let's explore. Damn. Ruck up. Okay. Let's see where this leads. Oh, what's this? Oh, just more healing things, which means I'm gonna fight some jackasses. Which I'm okay with, I guess. I need some action. The old car tracks collapsed. It looks recent. I guess I'm not going that way. Smoke from deeper in the mine. An explosion? Bristlebacks. So they did come through here. They must have gotten trapped. I'm gonna have to take them out before I can look around. Aye aye, Captain. I think I'm gonna try and come up here. Oh shit, that shit came up here. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, oh shit. Yo, my man, it's not that serious. Oh gosh! Hey, my man, it's not that serious. Oh wait, did that dude die? Dope. Clapped. 
bitch. Okay. Better take a look at where the smoke's coming from. All right, what's all this then? There's a lot of smoke. Looks like mine runs pretty far back. Can I come back up here if I jump down there? Oh. There's a blaze here to blast a mountain open. And there's a note on one of the barrels. Oh. Note. What to say, Aloy? It's addressed to Oldland. This mine was supposed to be shut down. And it wasn't. It kept blasting deeper into the mountain. I should let Javad know what I found. Okay. Good to know. So do I just leave? Oh, I do. Alright. We're out. Secretly blasting in the mine. I'm trying to squeeze it for all it's worth. Sheesh. Here's the back stampede through. Maybe the explosions blew away open? But from where? My girl Aloy just asking the right questions. I'm just like, uh, I don't know. Where am I going? news do you bring? Picked up the Bristleback Trail by the quarry. Looks like they stampeded out of a mine at the back of the valley. The mine? How could a herd of Bristlebacks come from there? I'm not sure, but Alvin's workers were using explosives to tap the tunnels inside. For the love of Dawn, I told him it wasn't worth the risk. Those tunnels, they run for miles underground, even beyond the Daunt. No, you don't think that Alvin's blasting opened up a passage from the other side? Mm. Perhaps. Yes, perhaps. If this is true, we need confirmation. An inquiry so thorough, so irrefutable, endorsed by the Savior. Oh, right. here we go. I'll keep looking. Do I have to go back there? I need to go. Of course. If I'm gonna find out where the bristlebacks came from, I need to head for the west. Ah. Another reason to get the embassy going. So I guess that quest is done. Hey. Oh, it's on hold. Okay. That hurt. All right. So I guess if it's on hold, then um, next step is the embassy, right? About time. And that shit's all the way the fuck over here. Fuck. Oh, man. Let's get one of these chargers. We need a charger horn anyway, so. Let's go. Um, hmm. We can always get charger horns later. I mean, they're not hard to get. I just need to. Okay. I'll figure it out. Don't worry. I'll get a charger horn and a charger to go to wherever I need to go to. Because that. Back out here is a bitch so there's a bunch of burrowers as well i just have to get the charger horn before they die right easy peasy and i ran out of ammo because i'm an asshole i'm hurting for a squirting right now got him
There we go. Now I need a ride, and I have just angered the tribe. This burrow is not doing his job, worst security guard ever. He's like, what? Who? Dummy. Alright, so, yeah, I got the horn. I got two horns. I need three horns! Oh, god damn it. Fuck. Alright, whatever. Damn, son. Got him. Woo! 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 Oh, okay. Well, this guy's like, I'm just hornless. The unhorned one. Sit down. Doing all that for. Oh, is this one next to me? I hear stompity stomps. I should have enough charger horns for Dylan Boom, you know? Just need a rib from that fang horn they were talking about. Alright. We can always do that later. I just want a charger. If you don't mind being my horse. If you don't mind being mine. Watch, I'm gonna fuck this guy. I'm gonna fuck this guy up. I'm gonna fuck him up. <laughs> you can't see me. You can't. Look at that. You fucked yourself. You played yourself. Uh, Alright. Sorry for killing your friends. I'm out. Anointed out. Peace. So I really like um, how they made the riding feel a little bit. It's kind of woozy looking like a uh, amusement park ride, but it, the cinematics of it is pretty nice. On the barren light. Oh shit, it's the corruption. I wonder what it will do to the horse. Or me. Oh, still fucks me up. <laughs> Good to know. I could have got a charger down here. Oh, don't matter. Oh, barren light is like right there. I thought this was going to be a minute away. I could have walked here. What did I miss out on? Coming this way. I done passed this thing and. Oh shit, there's raccoons over here? It tells you where the raccoons are? Nice, I need that. I'll come back for it later. Baron Light. The last part of the sundown before the forbidden lost. That's right. Let's get to it. Alright, I should find whoever's in charge here. Hey, are you in charge? First, I could resupply my stash. Might be worth taking a look around. Ah, savior. <laughs> Tell ah, savior. me, are you seeking passage into no man's land by any chance? No woman's land. Why do you ask? Ah, well, to hammer it plain, there's treasure out west. Unclaimed Is there? scrap and ancient metal. Mm, and I've mm. got a sturdy band of salvagers that knows the lay of the land. You're not afraid of the Tanakh? <laughs> Terrified. But I carry out most of my <laughs> business in no man's land. A neutral territory and all that. Barren light is our port of entry. Mm -hmm, when its mm -hmm. doors aren't closed for an embassy. Uh, I was hoping your arrival meant they might be opening soon. I've got a business to run, after all. I want that embassy to happen as much as you do. Believe me, I'm working on it. Good to know. <laughs> Good to know. <laughs> and uh, keep us in mind. If you do manage to open the way, our main camp will be just past Baron Light. We'll buy any scrap you've got on you. And if you're looking for machine parts, we've got the best in the West. Guaranteed. All right. Maybe later then. Uh, if you could get those blasted gates open. <laughs> All right, you done talking? Shut the fuck up now. I got to give me the quest. Jeez. I'm not the only one who wants to get those gates open. Uh, duh. All right, what else we got? What else we have? Um, goods. We have a thing here. We got a campfire. We should probably go see. Up here, sister. What? Who the fuck said that? No, who cares? Oh no, a strike table. Cool. I'm gonna ignore that. 
Uh, cook. It tastes nice it Come on then. Bitch, what? It'll smell good? What? <laughs> okay. There's errand. Looks like he's had a few. Savior, I need your help. Hey Don't embarrass yourself, soldier. Savior! Savior. Was good. You're my last hope. Conover. She's Meridian's savior, not yours. It's eh. just Aloy. What do you want? Please, no one will listen. But the Eclipse. They're here in the don't. Really, Conover? Aloy's the one that defeated them. You're bothering her with this hogwash now? I mean, Some yeah, but I didn't kill them all. The the Duh. I saw one of our sentries, Lorovic, sneaking off to meet with one. I tried to eavesdrop, but they spotted me. And then Lorovic tried to kill me. I... Mm -hmm. Fought back. It was him or me. Unfortunately, there's no hard evidence that connects Lorovic to the Eclipse. And since Conover doesn't deny killing his fellow soldier, Nozar sentenced him to death. Oh, so what you're makes fucked. you so sure Lorovic was working with the Eclipse? Well, I was too far to hear everything. But I heard them both say the word. Eclipse. What? It's not the most outlandish claim I've heard, but it's up there. Crying Eclipse is a convenient way to dodge a death sentence. If I have to die, so be it. But if we ignore this threat, others are going to die too. <laughs> okay. Let's hear. Let's hear. Tell mom. me exactly what happened. We like I heard him say Eclipse. During a shift change, some <laughs> so the... trespassers slipped through the gate. <laughs> By it's like hearing anyone a, noticed they were halfway It's like hearing a, a Muslim person Nozar say didn't see the need to give um, fucking Let the Alu Akbar. Take care of him, it's like oh! Nazar's not one to be sidetracked. He tightened up the patrol Just schedule, freaking out for no reason. the sentries, and everyone moved on. But I couldn't stop thinking about it. None of us are careless out here, meaning someone left it open on purpose. And Larovic, well, he's always grumbling about officers. But on this, this looks like fucking Tom Holland. He's too quiet. And after the incident, he started acting different, jumpy. So when I spotted him sneaking out of the barracks after hours, I followed. I found him arguing with a stranger. And when Larovic mentioned the eclipse, I, I tried getting closer, but they heard me. The stranger took off, and I want Lorovic this story to be a life. huge, big misunderstanding. The instincts took over, and he just killed the man for no reason. Sentries heard the scuffle and found me standing over his body. This is just like the quest in the last game, um, the um, from the cut in the, the DLC. you witnessed. Did you hear anything else about their plans? No. But the clearing where they met is just east of here, across the river. A dozen soldiers have already searched at Conover. There's nothing there. I but do they can have a focus? see things others can't. If the Eclipse are in the Daunt, I'll find them. Thank you, Aloy. Sun bless your search. Don't get your hopes up, soldier. Big facts. You know, you're a soldier, but why are you so dirty? <laughs> Fucking dirty Tom Holland. All right. Awadis. Hey, it's Aaron. Gentlemen. What up? That's our cue. Oh, shit. <laughs> Damn. You taking the edge off? Oh. I mean, I'd ask you to join, but who'd be left to save the world, right? All right, now let me guess. You're in a rush, right? So, uh, whatever you need, ask away. Hmm. How have things been since I... Your silent departure? <laughs> yeah, not bad. Vanguard's going strong. Helped Avad pick up the pieces after the battle with the Eclipse. And I took a month to bury Ursa in the clay. Mm. But when I got back, I got the assignment to babysit Wadis on his way to the embassy. A oh, Wadis? That'd be a cakewalk, so of course things went sideways. You got blindsided. It wasn't your fault. <laughs> a couple more of these, maybe I'll believe you. What do you know about the embassy? I know not much. Only that Avad really wants it to happen. He said I'm making peace with these Tanakh. 
But from what I hear, they're not too big on the whole diplomacy thing. They do most of their talking with blades and arrows. I like so them. if you're heading their way, be prepared. I love them. Things might get ugly real fast. I'll keep that in mind. <clears throat> what do you know about this place? Well, nothing good. It's where the cards are dragged all the captives they took from the Forbidden West during the Red Raids. Oh, lucky ones came slave labor. The rest were hauled off to the So it's a plantation. Labor. For sacrifice. You got it. Tanakh made sure to wreck the place before they chased the Karja out of the West. I can't say I blame them. And now Avad's paying the Azram to rebuild it. And no matter how much new stone they put up, it'll still be stained in blood. Okay, Mr. Poet, calm down. It really did a really, just the animations, the postures, the vibes, all of it creates a scene much akin to like fucking Uncharted. You know, it really does show Sony's commitment to creating amazing IPs and stories around those IPs as well. Like, all of their exclusives are just monumentally great. I don't know about The Last of Us Part 2. I haven't played it yet. I haven't played The Last of Us 1, but I've heard bad things about The Last of Us Part 2. But even so, like, I don't know shit about The Last of Us, but I know Ellie. And that is a testament to how um the game development process and how they market their ips and creating amazing games i wouldn't be on playstation if it wasn't for the fact that they had such great exclusives i um i better get going oh uh, yeah don't let me stop you just are you, are you sure about this yeah, i'm saving the world that's that sounds like a lot for just one errand yeah all right can't blame you for trying I, I guess what I'm really trying to say is if you ever do need me I know where to find you hopefully sober next time yeah don't count on me I'm sorry Aaron be careful out there Aloy. I, I'm not gonna fuck you <laughs> Ho there. Ahura. Plot. <laughs> all right time to get on to the embassy and as soon as we um move with that mission uh, we can end the episode oh it's inside good thing there's this convenient door lighten up Pai. you've got a thick wall of stone between you and the Tanakh up there yes sir why the long face my boss wish you were heading out there no sir are you in charge around here Ah, apologies, no. That would be Commander Nozar. I'm Lawan, the second ah. in command. So, what brings Aloy of the Nora to Baron Light? I'm here for the embassy. I need it to happen so I can head west. Makes sense. And maybe now that Studius Wadis is here, we can finally Wadi. get things underway. Ah, <laughs> yes, the Sun Priest. Walked in practically kicking and screaming behind his escort. Really seems to like his scrolls. Big facts. But the embassy remains delayed. Commander okay. Nozar has signaled our readiness, but the Tanakh marshals have yet to sound their horn. Huh. So I have to deal with that. All right, fine. Let me through the gates then. I have my own business with them. I'm sure you do, but I'm afraid I can't. Commander's orders. Of course Normally, it is. the gates are open for any who dare to venture out. Asaram salvagers, a few especially brazen Karja, but no one's allowed in or out before an embassy. Now we're open. Once the Tanakh have left. You said something about Tanakh marshals. Who are they? They're the tribe's elite warriors. Before every embassy, they arrive with a contingent of soldiers from each of their three clans. Then, during the proceedings, they negotiate on behalf of their leader. And by negotiate, I mean, stare down our sun priest until they concede. Ah. Eve over here came face to face with them for the first time at the last embassy. <laughs> came back drenched in his own sweat. It was hot that day, sir. Yeah, I... <laughs> it was indeed. Bitch made. <laughs> <laughs> Where is this Commander Nozar then? If he's the one keeping the gates shut, I'll convince him to open them for me. Hmm. 
I'll take you to him. But I have to warn you. The commander isn't one to break protocol, especially when he's already high strung. We'll see about that. Facts. I'll just stab that dude in his kneecap. <laughs> Fuck out of here. I ain't got time to be playing with y'all. Hurry up. There's a lot of activity going on around here. The Tanakh tore down this place during the Red Raids. Two years of labor, and we still have a long way to go. The work stopped Hurry up. Change Creek nearly halted our rebuilding efforts. But I hear a certain Nora got them back to work. I was just helping out. Yes, well, I'm sure Alvin was thrilled. Of course, I will have to say that sometimes you have situations like this where you're just listening to story. Stand aside, soldier. Sir. Move, bitch. Get out my way. Get out my way, bitch. There's the commander. Get out my way. Better brace yourself. And good luck. Damn, son. Can you move any slower? Like the fuck? Ain't no fucking way. All right, move out of my way, Why bastard. How are we to hold an embassy with a tribe that can't even govern their own people? What oh. more can you expect from barbarians? So you're a racist. I see. <clears throat> what up, bit? Oh. Aloy, was it? Yo, yes. keep playing with me. What is? cleared the valley for you? That Aloy. <laughs> we appreciate your service. At least we are ready for the embassy to begin. Didn't you just give the signal? Both sides must signal readiness. Until the Tanakh sound their horn, we wait. Yay, for as the first... Yo, I'm about to throw that shit, stop. son. <laughs> That's the right. Way? The Tanakh are a tribe composed of three clans. How many banners... Look how salty he looks! <sighs> You're just gonna wait? Go find out what's wrong. The fuck is wrong with you? Oh, this isn't some forgotten corner of the East where you come from, Dora. What's that it's supposed to mean? West. Okay. If you don't like it, run back to Meridian. File a complaint. The Yo, I will I clap you. you. I will right. clap all of you right now. Nobody walks to the gate until the third clan arrives and the Tanakh horn has sounded. Not even the savior of Meridian. Nigga, I don't give a fuck. Who do you think I I'm going now. Well, thanks, but I've waited long enough. It's time to go. Absolutely not. This embassy depends on diligent adherence to. <laughs> you shall not. Keep that. <laughs> He's like, watch. I'm I'm a, a what now? Oh shit! Oh god damn it! Fuck! I gotta deal with this shit. <laughs> Open the gates, please. Please. Do not let her through that gate. That is a direct order. Sorry. Can't do it. Here comes... Oh. <laughs> He's like, you can't, huh? He shaved? <laughs> My dude actually had time hey, to shave. Hi, Aaron. Uh, what's happening? I know the usual. Aloy wants something. People Open try to stand in her way. It's not gonna work. Arrest her. I like to see you try. Come off. Let's do it. Yo. Supporting fire. Yeah, I'm locked and loaded. Hey, nose off. You stupid bastard. You think you got the authority to keep that door shut in the savior of Meridian's face? What, I would like to think, think so. Son King of Vod is gonna do when he hears what you did. Promote you, huh? <laughs> and it through, boys. Saving the world. It's like, good luck, black man. Back in Meridian? No, I did not forget anything. You made it just in time. I would not. Oh my god. Damn it. Aaron's like, oh, so you like dark meat, huh? <laughs> Tribe that Murad told us about the Tanakh. Hey, yo, calm we down. Permission to go west. Where the fuck are you going? Yeah, well, I figured it'd be weed? nice if they weren't trying to kill me the whole time. What's this weed? But this embassy Oops. hasn't started yet. We're just gonna barge in. It's no more politics. No more delays. Oh well. Now at least you have some backup. I could literally slaughter myself. 
We'll see how it goes. I'm Jesus. Have you forgotten? Like, I don't understand. People be forgetting that I'm Jesus. Oh, hello. You look fucking weird. I don't know. They don't look as snazzy as everybody else. This chick is over here ready. Everybody's like, I don't give a fuck. That is the line between east and west. Cross it and die. Hold on now. Calm it's down. Easy. None may walk this valley until our signal sounds. That was our accord with the Karja. I'm not Karja. I came here on my own to ask for rite of passage. But they opened the gate for you, did they not? What is the meaning of this violation? Why send a child? Do they want to parlay or not? The hey. Karja can't be trusted. This is no. I forget the Karja. I don't give a this fuck about them. To do with them. We're not even Karja. We need to go west to save lives. Maybe even yours. The only lives you can save are your own. By turning back now, oh. I can clap. Oh, uh, who that? She's telling the truth about one thing. She's not Karja. I'm not. She's a Nora from the Savage East. I am. And if she seeks to save lives, should we not listen? Let I me. suppose. One last favor for a fellow marshal before he's taken away. What? What is going on? All right, let's talk. <laughs> I like how they literally are talking on the line. They the literally cannot pass that line. You must be the so-called savior of Meridian. Just Aloy. <laughs> Just I am unyielding Aloy. Fashav. Once okay. of the Karja High Command, last of the army of the setting sun. You're Wait. Fashav. Vod gave me a message for you. That he waits for you in Meridian, where you belong. Hmm. Oh, he's Karja. That's weird. Vod always was polite. Well, now I'm even more curious about you knowing that you have the confidence of the Sun King. But such an association with the Karja could work against you here. As it always I mean, has with me. Uh, yeah. Tensions are high. This embassy is a delicate affair. They're about to return me to the Sundom, a gesture that might help soothe painful grievances. And now you arrive, unheralded. I'm not here to cause trouble. I just I need to just go need west. to go west. <laughs> say. I might be able to help, but I need right. to know why. Along with some assurance that I won't. You asked why I need rite of passage. I'll tell you, but you won't like my answer. Six months ago, the world almost ended in Meridian. That threat still exists. It's getting worse every day, much worse. Calling down storms, poisoning the water, enraging the machines. So basically the nothing has changed. Has gone west, and I'm the only one who can stop it. I've seen the signs. And I've heard tales of incredible occurrences in Meridian, an army of demons vanquished by a red-haired champion. So I'm inclined to believe you. Cool. The burden of your task is written across your face clearer than any mark of mine. All right, so we, we good? I'll Can I... you this, to serve as proof of your right to travel into Tanakh lands. Hey, Just you. The task's so important, and it's just the two of you. Take it from one who aspires to be a diplomat. Allies are essential. Chief Akaro knows the West better than anyone. He may be able to help you. He can be intimidating to others, but don't let that deceive you. He is a man of his word. Maybe. If I need him. Your choice. Bet. You can find him at his palace, past the mountains to the southwest. Palace? Tell him I sent you. And he'll listen to Look! The Sky Clan's banner. Oh, dope. So that means we're good to go and I didn't need to talk to you at all? Or is this dickhead gonna Marshals. stop me? It wasn't easy, but I brought the Sky Clan with me. And the commander? Uh, no. I could only convince a few. He isn't yet aware we left. 
this dude. We have banners from all three clans. If there are fewer from the Sky Clan, it can't be helped. He's right. Sound the horn. So I literally could have waited like what five minutes. <laughs> Not all Tanakh can stomach the idea of parlay with the Kaja, but enough have come for us to begin. Then I'll be on my way. No, the other marshals will not permit it. If you wanted safe passage, you have it. After the embassy. Ah, oh, fucking hell. This is fucking bullshit. <laughs> Wadis is like, oh, we're gonna kill them niggas. <laughs> Come on, you bum ass bitches. The Karja have opened the gates. What is that? <laughs> Coffin? <laughs> As the sun rises over a land at war, so too can it set over a land at peace. Today is such. Oh, what? Hear me, marshals! You who claim to be Tanakh! Oh, here we go with this shit. Regala. Chief Akaro's biggest mistake. A rival whom he should have killed. Thanks for the exposition, dog. You have forgotten that our people were born in blood. The blood of the Karja. Instead, you pledge your spears to a chief. Are, is that a face or titties? With the enemy. Hikaru has betrayed us. The embassy is proof. And all of you marshals are his accomplices. What the fuck are you talking for this, about? I condemn you to death. Huh? You'll need more than toothless threats to intimidate us. Hey. Exile. Oh, oh. Mm. Oh. Ain't no fucking way. <laughs> so what up? <laughs> you got one of these? I don't think so. <laughs> Lancers, pour them up. Okay, so they're also machine builders. They're riding machines. Huh. Where'd they learn to do that? I don't fucking know. I just got here. Bro. Sorry. Silence, you bitch ass nigga. Fashav, come with us now. Oh, not at all. He's like, yo, I'm up. Archers, light them up. They're about to get fucking fucked up. Oh my god. This is like PTSD for Aloy all over again. Not again. No. <laughs> Man, these guys are assholes. Look at this dude. Dickhead. Dumb motherfucker. Alright. It's fighting time. Wow. Son, was arrows that OP in the day, son? Like, really? Like, these are just getting clapped. There's no way arrows were that OP. Wow. It was like. Oh, 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 oh. Damn, son. I'm getting smoked, and I'm gonna have to violate everyone here. That's sad. Maybe I should have got more weapons and upgraded my armor. Ah, I'll be alright. They're not gonna make it. Look at Studious Wadis. More like Studious Wadis nuts. <laughs> Yo, my dude's about to fucking die. <laughs> what do I do? What do I do? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's over for this man. Oh, he jumped out. No. Clapped. <laughs> oh, GG's. Y'all niggas gonna do something? It's like, what do I do? What do I do? You have many shots. You just have to take them. Oh, I see you. Oh, GG's, bitch. Oh, never mind. Damn. Okay. Oh, man. He's clapped. So, am I gonna fight? Is this. Oh, shit. What is this, Gladiator? 
Oh damn, my dude. One man on. Oh, oh. Never mind. He is dead too. They're all dead. Every last one of them died. What happened? Can you see? Everyone clapped. It's just us now. Damn. Hey, come down and fight fair. <laughs> Lancers. Why did you let them know your presence, Aloy? What's wrong with you? Get ready. And he's like, oh shit. <laughs> Damn. Alright, time Take to run. The cover. Archers on the ridge. Kill the rebels. Oh, getting clapped. Thank you for the ammo. All right, all right, all right. Oh. Gotta get more ammo. Giles playing with the wrong bitch today. You could use some help. Okay. Good shit, Borrow. Whoa. Why are you going to cutscene? I was enjoying myself. What the fuck? Hey. Hey. Damn, son. You hate to see it. Oh shit! Oh! Oh! This man is raw! Damn, my dude! Oh, it's clap. It's over for you. Damn! These niggas is raw. <laughs> All that for what? <laughs> okay, now we got some bristlebacks. Okay, I'm getting fucking. <laughs> yeah, you did, you dick. <laughs> you just want to do something? <laughs> Let's use this shit now. Since I almost forgot that I had it. Damn, there's so much shit going on. That one. Ain't no fucking way that shit just charged me like that. Okay, I think this is OD now. Stop! Oh my god! Ah! Oh my god! There's just so much shit going on! Oh my god! I have trip casters that I forgot about. What's this? Light arrows. I thought I had that already.
Bruh, I seen that shit coming to my left. I'm like, Hello, get bitch. That shit was hectic. Damn, son, you really do not have the time. Stop. Good bro, my nigga. Son, the way these dudes be charging at you is ridiculous. It's dead. Um, okay. Wow, I only had two hogs to kill. And now here's this bitch. Enough. Oh, enough. Enough what? You, Outlanders, I'll skin you both. Okay. Grant me the honor of this challenge. Agruda. Granted. So, one v one. Cool. When you, yo, what the? F oh, hold up! What in the breath of the wild? <laughs> what in the Fortnite? <laughs> oh, it's like, dude, you don't have it. In I'm fucking Captain America, bro. <laughs> This is, some, this is some vibranium Wakanda shit. I'm just chewing out references. Like oh, no time to be doing that stupid you shit. Ah, uh, did I need to scan it for to know that? I feel like I would have known that. Oh, oh, this dude is amazing. I gotta get through that shield. Duh. Aha! I broke your fucking shield. It's crazy. It's crazy how you thought just with that shield you were gonna violate me. But I'm amazing. You did not know this. Did you not know this? I don't think you knew this. And now you will know this. You're not stopping me. You're not stopping me. Oh, I forgot he can do that. Maybe I should get heals? I literally have to hold to sh Last one. I've got to break that shield. Shield shot. He's horrible. Oh, well, he's dead. He wasn't so bad. He was kind of crazy, but he wasn't so bad. I'm happy that they added shit like that to the game, because really... <laughs> this dude is just bare naked on the floor. It was definitely night. What no. happened? <laughs> no! It was an honorable challenge. You've earned your life today. It sounds like you're pussy. Comrades! Mark this day! Today you have decimated the marshals, slaughtered the Karja. So begins our war on Ikaru. Who? Ah! Move out. 
The fuck are you talking about, bitch? Yo, fuck this chick, honestly. Like, doing the most. For what? For what? Nothing. Dumb hoe. The bro's over here dying. Oh, oh, these guys are still alive. Somehow. Even though they were stabbed multiple times. Get him to the camp. Now. Bro's like, no, no, no. no I'm, I'm good. I'm good. I'm right. You gonna make it? Hell no. You're going on without me, aren't you? Yes, I am. Guess I'm stuck with Aaron. For now. Come on. I'll take you back to the fort. I think it's gonna have carried me like they, you carried all these dead people. That's crazy. <laughs> Look at both these niggas limping. <laughs> That's crazy. That's crazy. Okay. Scene transition. Well, the doors are open. You got the doors open for you. I don't know if you want to go it's out there. Salvage time, boys. Hey, 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 hey. All those machines that were dead there, those are mine. Don't. Look at the AO like, hey. What the mother ass y'all doing my thing, boy? I like how we just... I guess I'll be taking that shield of yours. This is all mines. Yoinks. Don't think it can take a hit. I should be able to use it to glide. <sighs> what in the breath of the wild? <laughs> Fucking Horizon is just taking every little new piece of um, gameplay from any other overworld, um, open like world, and just perfecting it in its own. That sounds about right. The marshals weren't expecting Regala to attack. And the entire Karja delegation was slain. Those are Wadis. Wadis. Shav. A massacre. Yeah. What will you do now? I'm gonna have to head west. dip. <laughs> Hopefully this rite of passage is still good. I don't for what I'm after. Don't know. I'll solve to knock the territory if I have to. Then you have a long road ahead of you. This is only the threshold of the Forbidden West. The Tanakh's true domain lies over the mountains that border Plainsong, home of the Utaru tribe. This isn't Tanakh's territory? All that out there? That's no man's land. It was supposed to be neutral ground. Though, obviously, this Regala ignored that. Her rebels approached from the north, with all those machines they were riding. They must have made camp up that way. The rebels were riding bristlebacks. And there were bristlebacks in the Daunt. Mm. Are you saying the rebels let them into the Daunt? How would that even be possible? You ask a lot of questions for a guy who don't know but any it's answers. Worth into. While you're at it, there were a number of Karja and Asuram who went out there before the gates were shut for the embassy. Maybe you could check in on them. See if they're all right. Great, side quest. Keep an eye out. Is there a tall neck somewhere nearby? A tall neck? A what? There's that one over there. Uh, that. The Tara border. But why? It's, uh, it's hard to explain. It'll help me get the lay of the land. If you say so. Is there anything else I can tell you before you go? I am not about to sit here and ask you all these questions. I need to be on my way. Then I wish you luck. The gates will always be open to you should you wish to return. And don't worry about your friends. We'll get them patched up. Good. Because they're a bunch of scrubs anyways. Hey, Aloy. Sun, watch over you, Aloy. I hope you find what you're looking for. Me too. Otherwise, this will be a waste of everyone's time. I mean, it's not like sequels to ever do that, ever. Alright, I think this is a good place to stop the episode. I feel like, um, 
Horizon has ultimately the longest um, episodes by far. There's just so much packed things that this stop giving me new information. Shit. <laughs> There's just so much really just packed in to the story and I just want to get through it in a very quick and very um you know fulfilling way I don't want to like leave much out but sometimes there's just so much so it's just you know it's a good medium uh, I'll have to figure it out when I edit but I otherwise I really do hope you guys have been enjoying these episodes I I'm having fun I'm enjoying myself and there's so much more to explore we're finally going into the Forbidden West, finally. So I hope it's everything that you know it's supposed to live up to. I, I can see the tall neck all the way the fuck over there, actually. All the way back there. It's crazy. But um, thanks you guys, thanks again for watching. I really appreciate it. Drop down to the comment section, let me know what you think. Like or dislike the video, you know what to do. And subscribe and hit that bell icon so you can stay updated on what I'm uploading. And as always, I'll see you on the crossroads. Farewell. Thank you.